All right, I'm going to show you how to use a really cool Gmail feature, which I actually didn't know about until very recently, and it has since saved me a lot of time. Uh, it's called Canned Response, and it's uh, part of Gmail's Labs uh, add-on features. And uh, it is essentially what it sounds like. It gives you the opportunity to pre-write some emails and, e and quickly add those responses as replies to various emails. Um, prior to this, I was copying and pasting from a swipe file and it was much more time consuming uh, and this is a really handy little tool that has saved me a lot of time so I'm going to show you how to use it the first thing you want to do once you're in your Gmail account is come up here to settings or options rather click on that and then the mail settings drop down will pop up click on that and then we come over here and click on labs and let's see we're looking for canned response just going to do a quick search there it is um, can, oops sorry closing windows here canned responses by Chad P simply click enable and scroll down and click save changes now that is literally all you need to do to set it up and now when you uh, go to compose an email you are going to see this little tab right here uh, next to invitation and attach file. Now I haven't added any responses yet so uh, there's not anything here. You can see uh, there's just this simple field new can response. So the first thing you want to do is open a blank email and you can technically do it as you go however I recommend you add your can responses to blank emails because if you have a signature or um, perhaps you're replying to someone in their email uh, original email messages copy below that will be copied over into your can response as well so uh, we start with a blank email click compose and then just type something like uh, hi thanks for your email I really appreciate the kind words John. So let's say, you know, as part of what you did, you got a lot of um, just complimentary emails or testimonials. I know uh, as a musician, you tend to get a lot of fan mail, that kind of thing. So uh, that might be something you might find yourself sending off to, uh, you know, replying to customers quite often. And rather than typing that out every single uh, time you get an email like that you can simply save it as a canned response so I've got everything that I'd want in that email there and then I click on the little drop down arrow there and click new canned response it's gonna ask me what I want to name it thanks for the nice email just something that will uh, oops, spelling error there something that will let you know what this response actually is click OK and now for our purposes I can discard that and let's open a new email so we have a blank email here uh, and this would work just the same if I was replying to someone uh, and uh, let's say uh, I did get one of those emails and I just wanted to thank them for the nice email I'll come to the drop down window again and click insert thanks for the nice email and there we go ready to go and I'd hit send uh, it takes a fraction of a second and you've responded to the email and it can get tedious typing the same words out over and over and especially when you're getting into more involved support emails with links and all that kind of kind of thing in it. and even if you're keeping it on a swipe file and you have to keep referencing your documents and opening it up you know it, it's gets irritating so this saves you a lot of time and you can use multiple can responses in the same email uh, let's say you know I don't have any other saved here but it, as you can see here uh, oops there we go you can see that it is added it twice oh three times there I guess the second one did take just took a little while um, but what this allows you to do is rather than having one sig uh, or one signature for all of your emails because Gmail does allow you to set up a signature you can create multiple signatures or even um, parse in multiple um, 
support emails into the same email, email because often you're getting people sending you uh, questions or multiple questions and perhaps you answer those questions quite frequently so you might have two separate canned responses and you could copy them both into the same email do a little cleanup and save yourself a lot of time so that's how you use it I uh, just wanted to share this tip with you folks again this little add-on has been a really welcomed addition to my business and it has saved me a lot of time so Hopefully uh, you can get some use out of it. Once more, this is John Ojaka, and for more marketing tips, you can go to musicmarketingmanifesto.com. That's musicmarketingmanifesto.com. Thanks very much.